Hey guys, Crewman here, and in today's video, I am going to show you how to get your RTX 5060 Ti 8 gig or 16 gig card installed in your PC in under five minutes. In this edition, we're going to use the PNY 5060 Ti model. So, without further ado, let's get to it after a quick word from today's video sponsor. The number one mistake PC gamers make is paying full price for Windows 11 just to get that that damn watermark out of the way. Never pay full price again thanks to VIP SCD keys. Use code MAN to get 20% off your next order and save over $150 for a Windows Pro key. And thanks to VIP SCD keys, you can take that money that you save, put it towards whatever you need for your build. And we're talking over $100, which is pretty incredible. They also sell game keys like Nightingale at a discount and you can use code KTT to get an additional 3% off your next order. So thanks again to VIPSCDKey.com for sponsoring this video and never pay full price on Windows 10 or 11 keys again. All right, so I'm gonna show you how to install this GPU onto this PC. So we're using my 5800X 3D test bench. Now it is an open air case, I know, but it will show you how to get this on your motherboard. Basically, you just have to use your imagination for a second and pretend that this is a PC that is laid on its side because that is how you should be installing one of these is on its side. So basically the thing you need to know about this thing is it does not use a 12 volt high power cable. It, it uses your standard six to six plus two pin, which is pretty standard on GPUs going back quite a while now. So you probably won't need another power supply for this thing. An older power supply will work just fine since it's TDP is so low. So essentially uh, this is pretty simple. I'm gonna show you basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna slide it on its side like this and you're going to want to make sure it slides right in to the p to the bracket on your motherboard it's called a pcie slot and you're going to hear a click and then once you hear the click you're going to pretend this is the screw and you're basically just going to screw it in and voila your gpu is installed onto your motherboard pretty simple right so then the next thing you have to do is connect the cable again this does not use the 12 volt high power cable, so you don't need to worry about it. It uses a PCIe 6 to 6 plus 8 pin, as I've already said, and it's simple. You just need to take one of your cables, which obviously the one thing you do want to do is check to make sure that there's no damage in the cable. There is no damage in this cable. You just want to plug it in like so. You'll hear a click. And you're golden. One thing you want to do is you want to check to make sure that there's no gaps between the PCIe cable and the GPU. But other than that, it's good to go. It should look something like this. That's it for this one. Thank you again to our video sponsor, VIP SCD Key. And uh, that's it. If you have any questions, please leave a super chat down below as it is kind of difficult to respond to every individual question. And I will get to all super chat questions. Otherwise, maybe someone else can help you. And I try to check back every now and then. But this guide will age with this GPU and it will work with all models. So that's it for this one. Thank you for watching and peace out.